Hi everybody, PJ here and today I'm going to show you how to program this little Yesu. It's the FT70D by hand. We're not going to use a computer to do this. We're going to input it by hand. Now why would you want to do that rather than using a computer? Say you're uh, travelling around somewhere, somewhere you've not been before and uh, you fancy doing a bit of modulation on the older la di da di da and uh, you haven't got a repeater programmed in for that area so we go on our phone and we get repeater book out on the phone uh, look where we are and find a repeater so today we're going to put a repeater in now I'm not going to be able to reach this repeater from here it's in Hothwaite which is about 27 miles from me and uh, the thing is going to put in, excuse me while I just look at my screen to make sure I get it right is we're going to put the uh, the frequency in which is 133.025000 uh, the uplink in, the offset, uh, the uplink tone and the call sign so we're going to do that and uh, I'll show you how to do it quite easily it's not difficult on this uh, on this little radio right let's crack on right so uh, let's start off shall we now the first thing we're going to do is we're going to press the V and the M button just here and that's going to put us into frequency mode and we're going to input our frequency which is 433025 so there we go so that's the frequency in there. Right, so we need to put um, our repeater shift in. So what we're going to do is we're going to press and hold the F key. There we are. <laughs> menu 45, I went to the wrong menu. And we're going to press the F key. And it says automatic shift is on, which is what we want. So we're going to press the F key again. And then we're going to go to menu 46. So uh, here we have the repeater frequency and we need a shift of uh, 1.6 so let's uh, get up to 1.6 on there and then press the F key again so that's a, a repeater frequency actually entered into the radio now now we didn't actually put in whether it was a negative or positive frequency so we're going to press the F key and the zero and it says positive simplex or minus now this is positive 1.6 now we put the 1.6 in so there we go we want a positive 1.6 uh, shift so that uh, they could talk to each other properly and there we go we just press the function key again right so now we need to put the tone in so we're going to press function 5 there you go we want tone that's the one that we want now you can see it says tone but there are other options there's uh, TSQL DCS etc etc now we want tone so there we go we make sure we set it to tone and then press the uh, function key now we need to put that tone in so we press F and 6 which is code and there you go look it's already set on 71.9 but we can change it just by turning the dial once we've got the right one, once again, we're going to press the F key. Now if you look just here, we've got a, an FM button. All we're going to do is we're going to press the mode, because this is a digital channel, and it changes to DN for digital. So there you go, FM and DN. And because this is a, a digital channel, we need it on... Uh, digital of course otherwise uh, <laughs> guess what it's not going to work right the only thing I need to do now is uh, the last two things is check the channel 
Now this channel's much too far away to reach on this radio uh, and my local ones I've already got plugged in so we're not going to test it all we're going to do now is name the channel okay so when you've done all this um, and you've checked it um, you're all ready to uh, actually program this into the channel now <laughs> if you have problems it can be one of two things it could either be the shift which is the plus 1.6 or it could be the tone so um, if you're uh, transmitting and not receiving or vice versa that could be the problem is or more than likely is going to be the problem anyway let's write this to memory so all we're going to do is press and hold the VM button for about a second and you'll see an F flatting flapping there now it says channel 15 that's where it's going to write it to that is my next available channel I can change it if I want but no I want it in channel 15 so what I'm going to do is I'm going to press the F and M button again and it goes blank and all I'm going to do now is put in the call sign now I can either do it with the dial like that so let's put the first one in which is G and then I press the band button and it moves on to the next place uh, the next one is B so I can do it with the buttons if I want so just press the A B button twice and press the band and then I want the number seven so I'm pressing keep repeatedly pressing the number seven button until the number seven comes up there we go and then we want H so I'm going to press the band and we'll just use the dial and press the band button again and we want a Q there we go I went past it okay now to hard set this in again all I'm going to do is press and hold the VM button okay so that's hard set in so if I press the VM button it comes up there and it's there right so that's it it's all set in all ready to go so that wasn't difficult was it to program this uh, cracking little radio in just take your time and if at any time you start getting stuck just press uh, hold on your uh, video and you can always go back and watch it again just to see what I've done anyway um, I hope you've enjoyed this video if you have please give it a thumbs up please share please subscribe and guess what I'll see you there in the next one bye everybody I'll see you soon